Hi everyone! It's Gamer Panda Rose, and today I'm going to show you how I stream console games on my PC using a capture card. So the equipment I use for today's video includes my PS4, but in the past I've also used this same setup for an Xbox and Nintendo Switch, and it works just as fine. I use Elgato's HD 60s capture card, which looks like this. As you can tell, I use it a lot. <laughs> Poor thing! I also use one USB-C to USB cable. And the last thing I use is an HDMI cord. Now that we've got all our equipment, let's set it up. First, make sure you have the correct software downloaded to your computer. Since I use Elgato's capture card, I downloaded my software from here. It's as simple as clicking download, selecting which capture card you have, and then Windows or Mac. And then download which one you want and you will get an icon similar to this. Now that we've got all our software downloaded, it's time to install the hardware. So first, plug in your HDMI cord into your console. Mine plugs into the back. And then you will connect the HDMI to the in side of your capture card. There is an inside and an outside. Make sure it goes in the in. Then, you're going to take your USB-C to USB cable and put the USB-C side in the in as well. And then your USB will connect anywhere into a USB port on your computer. Now when I play, I do not have anything plugged into the out port. And this is because I use the Elgato screen capture software. If I need what I'm playing to show up on a screen that's not connected to my PC, then I would plug an HDMI cord into the out and plug that into whatever screen I need it to. Here's something that's really important if you're using the PlayStation. You need to turn off HDCP in your PlayStation settings. If you do not disable this before you try to use the capture card, then nothing is going to work. So to do this, you go to your settings and scroll down to systems and then down to disable HDCP. Now let's see if it works. Open your game capture HD and turn on your PlayStation. In the top right it will show your capture card and if it's recognizing it or not. And it works. You can change your settings here as well and of course there are great recording options too. Thank you everyone so much for watching the video. I hope to make more tutorial videos in the future to help gamers and streamers have more access to the games they want to play. If you have any suggestions for future videos, please put them in the comments below. Uh, again, thank you so much for all the support. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a great day. Bye! Panda, 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 panda.